Okay. I'm going out with the girls tonight. I got these two dresses. Can you help me pick one? Ugh, do I have to? Come on, just picture I'm like your girlfriend. We're going on a date. Oh, gross. Just imagine it. Come on. Imagine you in one of those dresses. Gross. Okay, but that one. Was that so hard? It was like actually physically painful. Yeah. Ha ha. You're so funny. Hey, Mikey. I'm really glad to have a friend like you. Me too, dude. Yeah. It's like really hard to find a guy who's cool with just being super platonic. Dude, brother, I know. Like, we can just hang out and watch stupid movies. That's all we do, and that's cool because that's what platonic friends do. You're literally the perfect guy best friend. I like, know. I could never see you any other way, and I love it like that. Preach, sister. Preach. Oh, you know, actually, I had this one friend one time, Trevor. We were friends for like two years, and then out of nowhere, he goes, I love you. Oh, Ugh. oh, what a psycho, what a creep, what a loser. <sighs> right? Like you guys were friends, like us. And then he just goes and tells you he loves you? Exactly. After, after your friendship? I know. W imagine me, oh, uh, telling you that I loved you? Like, what would you even say? Like, what would you say? Like, what would you say? I literally don't even know what I would do. You don't know. I don't know either because it's so weird, right? That would be awful. Yeah. Ugh, oh, gross. I'd say the same thing. If you ever said that to me, I'd be like, oh, whoa, get out of my room. I would literally die of disgustingness. Like, I would hurl my entire guts out and then drown in it and pass away. Like, it would literally be crazy. I am so sorry on behalf of all men that guys like Trevor exist. Oh, come on. You don't have to apologize No, for but I do. But I do because so many good friendships like this are ruined because of the guys like Trevor. You are the best. No, you are the best friend of and me. And you know what? I feel like you never judge me either. Yes, like, yes. I can come to you with any problem. Like all my boy problems. I can come to you with all my boy problems. That's amazing. And that's a beautiful thing. And I would never judge you on your boy problems. But wait a minute. Is Blake acting up again? Because if he is, tell him that this friend is gonna get him. No, no, he's not. I mean, I know you would, but... Okay, no, but hey, not. you remind Blake that your friend Mikey, he's got a fist waiting for him. Actually, speaking of Blake, mm. he actually broke up with me last night. So, I'm the new single girl on the block. I love you so fucking much. What? Claire, I love you so fucking much. I have been waiting for this moment since you started dating Blake. Like, seriously, I love you. You're the perfect girl, and I just think about me and you all the time, and, and, and just the kids that we'd have, and the family, and the, and everything that we could do together, and you're just so unstoppable, and you're beautiful. I just want to hold you, and I, I know this all sounds weird, because we're friends, but, like, I, I think you feel it, too. Uh, please tell me that you feel it, too, because I just... Claire, give me something here. Mm -mm. Is this some fucking joke or something? Y yeah. <laughs> Obviously. Oh my god. Wait, you thought that was for real? That no, no, it was total, total jokes, Phil. I mean, Thank come on. I'm scared. Is, I love you. Like, oh, can you imagine? No, oh. I can't. No. That is gross. Oh, that'd be so disgusting. Yeah, thank God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna try on that dress. Right, yeah, go try on the dress. 